Ready to jump in and make a list on Ranker? Awesome. There are two different ways to build a Ranker list. Start your own from scratch, or re-rank someone else's list. Let's start with a re-rank, as it's super fast and easy. Let's do the best movies of all time. Voting, voting. This is addictive. Almost 300 people have made a ranking of this list so far. Let's say you want to make your own version of best movies. Click the blue button inviting you to re-rank this list your way. Now you're ready to rank the list your way. We've added the items you voted up on, but you can easily remove them if you don't want them on your list. You can see all the items on the list over here for you to pick from. I just noticed one of my favorite movies isn't here, so I'll have to add it myself. I can just start typing the name of the movie I want here and look for it in the results. Dark Knight Rises is right here, but if I didn't see an item that matched, I could just go to the bottom of the list and select the Create Item version. Now my added movie is on the list, and I can move it into the position that I want. You can also add an image to your list to customize it. That will make it look better on Facebook if you share it there. Just saying. And if you want to change the title of your list, or add a brief description about how you picked your selections, you can do that too. Once you've got it the way you want it, click Finished and Publish your list, and you're all done. Your list is now part of the ultimate list, and your votes and rankings have been averaged into the consensus on the best movies of all time. After you publish, we make it simple to invite your Facebook friends to check out your list and add their own versions. Just highlight the names of the friends you want to challenge, and we'll send them a link to your list. Okay, that's re-ranking. But what if you have an original list idea you want to build? Just go to the top of any page and click the blue button that says Create a List. First, you have to give your new list a name. Try to make it as clearly descriptive as possible so others will check it out. For now, I'm going to rank the best voiceover narrators of all time. From here on out, it works just like the re-ranked list. Add your items at the bottom of the page. Want to add new images or videos to go with each item on your list? Just hover over the Add button to the right and pick your choice from the drop-down menu. We pull in Flickr and YouTube searches for you, making it really easy to find the best photos and videos without ever leaving Ranker. So now you have all the items added to the list, and in the right order. By clicking here on the list options, you can decide how you want your list to be displayed and whether you want to let other people vote on your list. Remember that votes will change the order of your list, so if you've made a ranked list of your personal favorites and you want to keep the list in the same order, don't allow user voting. Otherwise, let your friends and the internet have a say. This tab also allows you to decide if you want to let other people add their own items to your list. It's a great way to get suggestions on ideas you may have missed when first writing it. This option lets you decide if you want other people to be able to make their own versions of your list. If we get enough other people re-ranking your list, we will turn it into an ultimate list. Wouldn't that be exciting? The answer is yes. Yes, it would. Don't forget that you can make your list a lot nicer if you add a list image and write a little bit about what you've ranked. If your list allows others to add to it, you might want to write up some criteria to keep irrelevant items off. Since this is a list about voiceover narrators, I'm going to suggest that part of the criteria for this list be that narrators never appear on the screen. Now you're ready to publish your list. Hit finished and you're all done. Your new list dashboard is open here, allowing you to take further action if you like. If your list doesn't look quite right after you published, you can also just go back into edit, or even just open up your list options box from right there. If you want to know more about how to take your new list and show it off anywhere around the web you like, be sure to check out our next video about the amazing Ranker widget.